School of Investment brings you update on Adani Scandal. The turmoil in Adani Group shares continues with loss of an estimated $100 billion erosion in market capitalization. The matter threatened stature of Gautam Adani in an esteemed club of billionaire index. India and Asia's richest tycoon Adani losing every day as his vast empire of company shares sinking at the exchanges. The latest in series of events suggest that Gautam Adani has shelved plan to offer $2.4 billion worth shares to global investors given huge controversy which is being in headlines around the world. Now Indian regulator the Securities and Exchange Board SEBI is also stated to be looking into huge share price wipeout. This avalanche on Adani Group is at the aftermath of January 24th activism of a U.S.-based short seller research report published by Hindenburg. The short seller reports are one of its kind events that occurs when a short investor publishes reports on their supposed target price. When this materializes, then stocks can go down big time as the case of Adani Group shares since January 24th. The shorting is a method to earn via falling of a share price. However, in this case Hindenburg is highlighting alleged corrupt practices in the group which included stock manipulation, alleged offshore tax havens, most notably in the island of Mauritius, and accounting fraud, the factor denied by Adani Group CFO on major media outlets and cited them as discredited allegations. Hindenburg short seller alleged accounting fraud over the course of decades. Hindenburg is a known short seller research group which highlighted issues related to impropriety in the Adani Group. Let's check out Adani Group and Mr. Gautam Adani. A big name since last decade. He is founder of Adani Group who made fortunes worth $146 billion as per the World Index till 2022. The important point to note is that $100 billion is being recorded in last three years or so which is mainly due to appreciation in stock prices of seven listed entities that has boomeranged in matter of years. The combined appreciation in share prices is above 800%. The companies included a Metabod-based multinational company Adani Enterprises whose share lost massive that is from 3,200-odd Indian rupee to around 1,700 Indian rupee in five days. This company has a reported revenue base of $8.8 .8 billion. The company is into mining and trading of coal and iron ore. Now the SEBI the regulator is probing alleged Hindenburg research about potential irregularities. This has caused concern in the minds of investors as this company is also being labeled as debt-ridden and overvalued. Here savvy investors must have lost fortune. Adani Group is denying the contents of Hindenburg, saying that the research has no understanding of Indian laws. In this backdrop, the Adani Group tried to get investor backing through a share offer of $2.4 billion to win back investor confidence. Some of the other companies included Adani Transmission, which has subsidiary Adani Electricity Mumbai Limited, Adani Power, Adani Toll Gas, including Smart Meters Technologies, and a new company Adani Wilmar, where it's being alleged some higher insider holding, which in that report is stated to be above 75% threshold. Hindenburg highlighted large portion of shareholders in the jurisdiction of Mauritius, a tiny Indian Ocean island which is famous for offshore shareholdings companies. Hindenburg also highlighted current ratio below 1 suggesting that liquid asset position of some companies is less than near-term liabilities. Hindenburg Research, which has got less coverage in India itself during this earth-shaking event given Adani Group's known company's link with local politicians and their weight and clout in Indian media outlets. Now Hindenburg is challenging Adani to file suit in U.S. on allegations. Adani is no stranger to controversy which ranges from polluting Mumbai beaches when one of its ship carrying coal sank to places such as Australia. The group has been accused in past on fishy transactions in its $2 billion car Michael Coal Mine in Queensland. It was an untapped coal basin resources dated back to 2010. Adani operated Abbott Point Terminal which is exporting Queensland coal. Also, Adani is accused of clearing 75 hectares of protected mangroves and blocking waterways. Let's see how this Adani group storm created by U.S.-based short seller research unfolds in markets. Will this erosion of share prices to result in erosion of confidence? For more updates, stay connected with us. Thanks for watching.